father and mother accused of the unthinkable. Police say they beat their five week old twin daughters to death. It happened last October, but the parents were just arrested yesterday. ABC 13's Luke Jones is live outside the Harris County Jail with what he's learned tonight. Luke. And Tom, police are basing these charges on the results of an autopsy which revealed multiple bruises and fractures. They concluded the kids were hit repeatedly with some sort of blunt object. But tonight, relatives of the little girl's mother says police should be focusing all of their attention on the girl's dad. A week after her twin daughter's death, Angelina Calderon started a GoFundMe account and raised over $1,200. But now police say she and the girl's dad, Fernando Vega, were responsible for their deaths. I mean, it, it's horrifying. It's horrifying. I couldn't imagine. Just five weeks old, the girls Masail and Marina were found dead at their southeast Houston home October 4th. According to charging documents, their skin was discolored, they had multiple bruises, and one girl had fractures. An autopsy concluded they died from multiple blunt force injuries. It kind of, you know, touches my heart to, to have two little kids like that. I mean, they'll be murdered by, the, by their parents. It's, it's, it's not good. At the time, the girl's dad claimed he left them with his grandmother while taking their mother to work. He told police he came home 30 minutes later to find them motionless in their bassinet and that he and another family member tried doing CPR. I mean, two innocent children. But Calderon's grandmother tells us her granddaughter is also innocent. And Calderon's sister describes her as one of the best mothers she knows. She says the day the twins died, her sister was at work and told her later through tears, I don't know what he did to them. Multiple family members say Vega was abusive toward Calderon. And two weeks ago, he was arrested for unlawfully restraining her. But Calderon's aunt says she should be held to account for what else investigators found. Both girls malnourished and some of their injuries days or even weeks old. Luke Jones, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.